Good morning, everyone. Good morning. Well, Amy, we have a, a big week as we went down the rundown of things just for this weekend. Uh, so we're just going to kind of walk through chronologically uh, here. And first, starting tomorrow on Thursday, uh, September 26th, uh, Timbercrest for Peace, our uh, Seniors for Peace over at Timbercrest, um, is having Cliff Kendi talk about um, the struggle of Native Americans uh, over this copper mine industry and the Oak Flat um, sacred grounds in Arizona. And so Cliff's going to be talking about that. I know a number of our folks are, are, are very involved in the Seniors for Peace. Anyone is welcome to come. And that is at 10 a.m. Uh, tomorrow. Uh, and then on Saturday, as we've been talking, we're having a watch party uh, for the Ted and Company show. Just give them the news. And um, I, it's, it's going to be a fun time. Timbercrest is going to be having a watch party as well. Uh, so know that. Um, it's at 730, either place. And just to clarify for our viewers, especially those at a distance, um, it is not our live stream. So it's not something that you'll be able to join with, with us, unfortunately, for this time. We are just given a link just to show here, but we're not streaming it. It's a, it's, it's a live stream link that's coming from uh, Bridgewater. So if you want to work through um, Honored Peace, there's a, uh, a way for you to give. It's less money for an individual to, to get the link than for a church. <laughs> and you can uh, get that link and you can watch it at home and support Honored Peace if you'd like that way. Again, we're not collecting donations ourselves. Everything should should go to be made out to Honored Peace. You can do that through their website. Um, very easily. If you're not comfortable doing that, you can write a check uh, for for two on Earth piece. Um, so that is Saturday, and then Amy, why don't you tell us a little bit about Sunday morning? Sure. Sunday morning is also packed with a lot of really important and good things. We begin with worship, and Jim Chinworth will be our preacher, and he's he's preaching on inclusion, not excision which is a very interesting word. I may have to look that up. We also will be taking a physical offering for Daniel's Place. This is our fall quarterly offering. So uh, you can bring a check or cash. And, and I imagine that Nan will invite us to dance up and put them in a basket up front. So that's in worship. And then in the education hour, we will be having our council meeting. We've been talking about this. I know you know it, but I'm going to say it one more time. So at 1045, be back in the sanctuary or just stay in the sanctuary, and we will do the business of the church in the fall. And this is this is an important part of our life together. So I hope that you will stay. Uh, we'll be approving um, a slate of uh, nominees and uh, the budget and receiving some reports. During council meeting, we will have child care for preschoolers through fifth grade. The junior high class will go ahead and meet. Mm -hmm. And I'm not quite sure what's happening with the senior high. Uh -huh. we're, 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 not meet, we're not meeting. They're uh -huh. invited to come to the council meeting. Uh, right. and, uh, so, or maybe involved in some child care uh -huh. between those two. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. And lastly, we do have physical copies of the council packet. You can stop by the church uh, today, Thursday, Friday from one to three and pick one up if you'd like, um, or just pick it up on Sunday morning. And I know that there are electric electronic links um, to these council packets out in a couple of emails. So if you, if you just want to find one, just contact us and we'll help you get one. And then to cap off the day we will eat together. We will have a, a, yeah, our first fellowship meal back after summer break. And so in case you need a reminder about that, just know that we're responsible for potlucking everything, uh, main dish, dessert, salads, all those good things. So bring bring what you can. And if you're not able to just come and there, there is always a, uh, an abundance and and people will, willing to share. So that'll follow 
at whatever time we finish the, the meeting, hopefully around the uh, somewhat normal time, but um, but that will follow there in the FLC. And during the um, the fellowship meal, we always take a collection for our brethren college student scholarships that we give to our youth who are attending a brethren college. So that basket is there at every fellowship meal. Toss something in if you'd like. Um, we know we know we have enough new folks that uh, who are just learning our our ways and our practices. So this is one of them. What a full weekend. Yeah, definitely. So we look forward to all those events. Please reach out if you have uh, any questions uh, or needs. Yeah. All right. All right. Bye. Bye, everyone.